All right, so it is, um, what day is it? It is Saturday, the 6th of March. I was gonna say February. I just got a phone call um, letting me know that our vet just did a palpation again. Uh, and Penny has a 35 millimeter, I think, 35 millimeter follicle on her um, left ovary. Our vet is giving us the go-ahead and is saying that we should order the semen tomorrow for delivery on Monday um, and hopefully we can get it in two separate containers so that she can um, inseminate on Monday and then inseminate again on Tuesday just to like double dip. <laughs> I, I don't have anything else to say right now. I'm just very excited and nervous and just kind of feeling very um, would you guys knock it off, please? <laughs> feeling very distracted is how I'm feeling. Stop it. I don't have anything else right now, so I will see you there. And yeah. It is Monday, the 8th, I think. And today we will be doing the insemination. It is about 3 o'clock in the afternoon right now. Um, we have not picked up the semen yet. We will be doing that in about an hour and a half. We will be going to SFO around 4.30ish um, to go pick up the semen. And then I believe we'll be meeting our vet at the barn um, and she'll do the whole procedure. But before then, um, we're gonna go give Penny some some uh, lunch. She's gonna be sedated, so she can't eat for a little bit after that. So we're gonna go feed her now, uh, or give her half of her dinner now. Um, and then she'll have the rest of it after. So that's the plan. Um, lots of stuff happening. I'm trying to control my anxiety because I'm like, I'm, the plane is still in flight right now and I'm like, such, I'm such a worry where I'm worried that it's gonna crash or something. We're gonna go do that now and I'm gonna take you along with me as usual. <laughs> All right, see you there. Hello, what's going on? Okay, let's get you that. Okay. He said about four pounds of Timothy grass. Um, I'm not really sure. I assume he means the stuff that's already opened. Because why wouldn't he, right? Four pounds of grass hay. We'll figure this out. I've never filled a hay bag before. <laughs> Not a real equestrian. Oh my god, no. this lady. Is that gonna be your baby? She's like, I don't know, man. So let's see what they sent us. Oh, okay. Well, you get one syringe. But, um... <laughs> I 
sister. Okay, you be nice. There's a honey bear. Am I holding her tail enough? You're perfect. Okay. Now, when I pull out, there may be a little blood on the glove. That's from going through the hymen. Okay. Uh, and that's normal for a maiden mare. Okay, found her cervix. I need another pipette. We cook it with gas. Okay, easy, sweetheart. We call this Titan's little one shot because I don't think we're doing this again. <laughs> so, okay, go ahead and attach the end of that syringe to that blue nozzle. Mm -hmm. You're in your first step to being a veterinarian. Okay. Okay. What I'm going to do now is okay. take this syringe off, okay. fill it with five cc's of air, and we're going to purge what's in the pipette because the pipette has five cc's of volume. So we're going to use every last cell. Yep. Okay. When this comes out, if she tries to break down or drop her pee, walk her, but I think we're going to be okay. No, no, no. She's not breaking down. Okay. Uh, sometimes, I mean, they're like so in Good girl, that they drop, And it's like the whole, everything you put in there, they dump out. And it's like, no. So now I'm just going to palpate. Okay. Well, her cervix is very soft, which you can tell because I was able to enter it. <laughs> she ovulated today. Thanks. Frickin' God. Yeah, off of the left ovary. Yeah. So we should be Johnny Spot on the money. And it's a big ovulation process. So that's a sweet. good thing? Yeah, it's a good thing. So okay. can you imagine if you, you had overnighted it? Yeah. Oh, you'd arrive thank God. tomorrow and you'd miss it. I'm gonna just check the right ovary. Right ovary, no change. Oh excellent. That's good. So we should have a singleton. We should have a singleton. Um unless so you know that there are two, I mean, she ovulated. While I was chasing her around. Probably. Um, All right, Penny. Will you text me when you come in the morning and let me know that she's It's awake. been done. Looking good and awake. Obviously, she'll okay. be awake by the morning. She'll be all grumpy trying to push those. Yeah. Okay, so <laughs> that was eventful. Um, we bred her, but we had a rough go at it because she does not like needles and she was having a really hard time with getting uh, sedated that's the word she had a hard time getting sedated um that took the majority of the time was getting her sedated we got her sedated and now she's inseminated and we will find out if she's pregnant in two weeks from now and in the meantime we're gonna work on her fear of needles and shots and stuff so yeah Today was eventful, and overall, it went well. Nobody got hurt. Um, she's inseminated. We got some work to do with needles. It's done. We've done it. I don't know what else to say. I mean, I'm I'm excited. I'm nervous. I'm tired. I'm hungry, and need to take a shower. <laughs> but it's been done, and hopefully, in about 11 months, we will have a little foal on the ground. I'm very excited. All right, so I'll see you all in the next video. Um, that one's probably going to be the uh, ultrasound or whatever, she, uh, finding out if she's pregnant or not. Um, and hopefully she is because I don't want to pay any more money to make this baby. <laughs> um, so anyway, I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Um, yeah, bye-bye.